The House voted to hold Steve Bannon in criminal contempt. Former President Trump's top advisor is now facing possible prison time if charged and prosecuted by the Justice Department. Our congressional correspondent Rachel Scott has the latest. Good morning, Rachel. George, good morning. The fate of one of Donald Trump's closest allies, Steve Bannon, now rests with the Justice Department. They will have to make a decision on whether Bannon should be prosecuted. He could face up to a year in prison if he is convicted. Nine Republicans joined every single Democrat in the House voting to hold Bannon in criminal contempt after he refused to testify or hand over documents related to January 6. Lawmakers investigating the insurrection say Bannon had specific knowledge about the events planned for that day before they occurred. Still, the majority of Republicans standing by ban and claiming it's all a witch hunt and a waste of time. This morning, Georgia, it is unclear how quickly the Justice Department will make a decision. And Rachel, meantime, President Biden did a town meeting on CNN last night where he was remarkably transparent, taking everyone inside these negotiations over his Build Back America plan, Build Back Better plan. It really was remarkable, George, and the president going on the record to say how much resistance he's been getting from two key moderate holdouts, Senator Kirsten Sinema and Senator Joe Manchin. Sinema opposed to raising taxes on big corporations and the wealthy to pay for this package. Manchin opposed to climate change provisions and tuition-free community college. The president now says they're down to four or five issues. He's confident they are going to get there, but bottom line, this deal would be far from what he wanted, George. Rachel Scott, thanks very much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.